Hi guys, welcome to Keys Moz. We're here at Coconut Creek Community Center in Broward County, Florida. I'm here with the fine children. What's Hello. up guys? Hola. We're looking for, this is our Wacky Worm segment. And uh, Wacky Worms, is, we're looking for butterfly moth caterpillars. And the whole idea is that right in urban South Florida, uh, we can go and look in our backyards and find some really, really cool bugs. We just need to know how to look for them and where to look and how to find them. And we're gonna teach you how to do that. Today, we're looking for the metal mark moths that feed on these strangler figs. And we've got a great big strangler fig here, uh, tree, and we're gonna look for some metal mark moths. Look there's some- a little cave in it. Little, there's a little cave. Sophie's really excited about going exploring in the cave. What we're gonna do is we're gonna find some metal mark moth larvae, and they feed on these strangler figs. They're some of the most brilliantly colored moths, definitely in Florida, probably the United States, and probably Hemorophilia diva might be the most colorful moth in the world, okay? How do you remember all these part of the deal, part of being a moth nerd. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to look for uh, little tiny, it's going to be on the new growth of these strangler fig trees and you're going to look for little tiny tents or little tiny silk uh, webbings of moth caterpillars and they are going to be in this new growth of this tree. Let's see what we can find. How about this? Alright, well th there's, some of them are moths and some of them are spiders so what we want to make sure we do, we, we don't want to Ew. put our hands in spiders webs, right? But here's, here's a good example, look Sophie, I already found one, come here. What? Yeah, check it out. This is a pupa shell of Hemorophilia diva. I don't know if he's still there. We're gonna take a look. It doesn't look like he's still there, but the pupa of the Hemorophilia diva, it looks like this. Looks like a spider web. Doesn't it look like a spider web? Up yep. there. Okay. It's got this white, this white webbing over the top of it. You can see some frass there that looks like it was from the larva. You can see the the holes that the larva ate in the leaf. Uh, but it looks like this one is actually gone, so we're gonna have to keep looking so this and see if we can find. Would you find another one? Yep. There's a lot of. So this right here is actually webbing for a spider, and there's our little spider friend. It might be a community of spiders, who knows? Uh, but that's definitely not what we're looking for. Uh, it won't. The webbing for the metal mark moths won't be quite as extensive, but what it might look like. It might look like a folded leaf like this. And we're gonna open it up. Whenever you open up a leaf, you, you never know what you're gonna find. It might be a spider, it might be a larva. Um, and of course, because this is strangler fig, there's always the possibility of finding a ruddy dagger wing caterpillar. So we're gonna keep our fingers crossed for that. But let's see if we can find some more. So there's two species for sure that live in Broward County. Uh, there's Hemorophilia diva. Oh, there's a there's a three spotted skipper. Camiides tripunctus. He's just hanging. <laughs> How cool. Yep, there he goes. So um, there's two species. Hemorophilia diva. Uh, they like to, their caterpillars actually rest on the surface of the leaves. They're, the other one, the other little tiny guy, is Tortyra slosonia. And Tortyria species, actually, their caterpillars actually burrow into the tips like this. And so this actually looks like the evidence of a Tortyra species where they actually kind of, they actually kind of burrow into the, the stems. Now we're talking. That looks like for sure a Tortyra slosonia larval casing. Because you can actually see the fresh frass build up there and the webbing um, this is definitely a caterpillar we're gonna we're gonna take this guy and home and see what we can find one down one to go actually this this little thing here is loaded with them check it out here's the difference between the slisonia and the diva hemorophilia diva the larvae actually sit on the surface of the leaves so this is a great example of uh, leaf damage from a Hemorophilia diva caterpillar. 
they eat, they scrape the, the surface of the leaves and when the larvae get a little bit bigger, they'll actually start chewing the leaves themselves and they actually pupate right on the surface of the leaf. Wow, look at all the Hemorophilia diva larva damage on this fig tree. All of these little leaf scrapings here is where diva caterpillars have scraped the green edible portions of the leaves are off the leaf and so and this this thing is just getting tore up funny enough I'm not finding any viable caterpillar oh wait is this one that might be a caterpillar no nope. that's a that was a diva caterpillar right there it must have gotten eaten by something well, the great thing about hunting for micros is that when you find one tree that's got them, boy, you can find a lot. This tree is completely infested. Every single one of the new little tendrils on this branch has a Slesonia larval casing on it. So this is really good uh, for our little hunt today. We're finding what we're looking for, for sure. And then of course over here, we've got a Diva. We've got Diva and Slesonia all over this thing. I've yet to see an adult for either one of them flying around, but the caterpillars are sure here. Uh, that's awesome. And here's one here, let's see. There's a larval tent. Let's see. Let's see what's going on here. Oh, there's a caterpillar. There it is, Hemophilia diva, guys. Right there. Oh, he just parachuted down. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, as a defense mechanism. <laughs> there he is. Oh my goodness. As a defense mechanism, a lot of caterpillars actually use this strategy. When they get disturbed, they uh, bungee jump off from their silk off of the plant uh, to avoid being eaten. Um, this guy dropped about five feet from his little housing. And that's not a very big caterpillar. I mean, you can see how big he is on my hand but he gave about five feet of silk to drop down on that strand in about less than a second so that is a pretty cool defense mechanism by this little guy cool we finally got a caterpillar for diva sounds good just found another diva pupa but you always got to be careful you never know what's going to be inside of a webbing is that a spider plant has certainly been good to us. There's a lot of diva on here, but I've yet to find a pupa. But I think I just did. I think I just found a pupa. Oh, cool. There is fi finally a viable hemorophilia diva pupa. Excellent. You can actually see the pupa alive inside of this little tent right there. That is exactly what we're looking for. So we're going to take him home, and in a couple days, a beautiful little hemorphilia moth will pop out of that. Sounds super cool. All right, guys. Uh, that's all we have for today. We found both species of metal mark moth caterpillars. It is hot because it's August. There's some kind of crazy beeping sound over there. I don't know what that is, but we're in the middle of a city, so uh, that's kind of par for the course when doing stuff in downtown uh, Bratton and Broward County so but what we got is we got our, we got what we came to look for is that worth a like yeah thumbs up yeah. What we about hope it? you like this video if you did smash that subscribe button yeah we gotta and subscribe we'll see you all next time yeah so here's what we're gonna do if you subscribe and hit the little bell the notifications we'll get you more videos like these and show you how to find more caterpillars more wacky worms of South Florida uh, guys check out the website it's W Hold on, wait, 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 wait. We, we can't do the website today. I'm in country, one, two, three. www.keysmods.com right, www We are on Facebook and Instagram. Check us out there. Until next time, let's get out there.